What's up guys? Welcome to the stone walkway or is it stone road? I think it's, I don't know. I mean, we would call it a stone road. Stone road, but you can't drive on it. So that's why I'm saying walkway. You can drive on it. There was the car up there. Well, not down the stairs. No, nah, you wouldn't be able to drive <laughs> down this part. We're doing a Japanese adventure tonight. So we started off at a vibey little cafe. Hungry. Does it pretty yummy? Yeah, it does. We were thinking about going to Starbucks, but I was like, oh, let's try something new. Hopefully it, uh, hopefully it turns out as a win. What is this one? Iced latte. No flavor or anything? Just straight iced latte? You'll need that to Tastes wake like up. I'm drinking dirt. Iced caramel latte. <laughs> Dang. That one's good. Thoughts? Probably one of the best croissants I've ever had. Really? Great. Yeah. Try this. Uh, it's just chocolate cake, right? Thirteen-year-old mm. anthem. Yeah. Mm -hmm. We were just talking about how not weird. Weird's not the right word, but I don't know another way to describe it. That it's odd. Odd. Yeah. Imagine you're at work, right? Or you go to a cafe, and it's just Spanish music, or Japanese music, or French music, or something like that. Maybe, I feel like maybe like French or Italian music is kind of vibey if you're like in a French or, a, or Italian place, right? Are cafes like American? Is that like an American thing? Is that why they play American music? I don't know. Because it's like the guy at the counter, front desk, he like barely spoke any English. So he like sits here on his whole shift and doesn't understand these songs, <laughs> you know? Like we could go up to somebody sitting over there. Obviously, English is a fairly well-known language, like, a, like an international language kind of, but not everybody learns it, you know? Isn't that just... Weird, not weird, odd, strange, unfortunate. <laughs> Doesn't like bother me, form. I understand the words, so. Probably get copyrighted for this. Mm -hmm. Well, this reminds me of middle school. Abby and Sadie driving Jody Cates' Jeep <laughs> down Old Dad's Road, and us like singing this. This I don't and, know like, if I know this song, what is it? Black Magic by Little Mix. And then we would listen to like Taylor Swift, like um, I Knew You Were Trouble, like. <laughs> all the red album or whatever. Jody like jam that? Yeah, and then Turned now that I think about it, like, I don't think Jody was with us some of the times. Like, It just makes you think of Jody Cates? Yeah, well, this one for sure, because we went zip lining one time for their birthday, and she was just like, mm -hmm, you know, driving. <laughs> <laughs> She's so cute. We have. We pour this stuff out, and then recycle. We got this at the mall. Oh, look. Tinsels. <laughs> Potty break. <laughs> What's the restroom? Toiletto. Toiletto? At least I think it is. Accidentally turned the bidet on, but I'm good. <laughs> <laughs> and then we found a parking spot right on the road. That's where we started. We're about halfway down, I think, so far. Our goal was to come here kind of at sunset. We spent way too much time at the cafe, honestly, but it was just a really nice place. Now we're gonna walk this whole road. It's about a kilometer and a half long. This is so hard to say because reading it in English, it doesn't make sense to how it, the Japanese letters would look, but it's Shri Kinjo Cho Road. And it sounds kind of familiar from our last video because Shurijo Castle is in the same town and it's right up the hill. We literally parked across the street from Shurijo Castle, which if you saw the last adventure vlog, that's where that was. And this is the Old Stone Road that leads up to it. How convenient that there's a parking lot right here by it, huh? That's probably why. We didn't even plan on it either though. We were just gonna park somewhere and we're like, oh, where's it at? Oh, it did. Oh, it's right here. And it leveled it. It just popped up? No, it didn't pop it up, it went. Oh, my bad. Dang. And then we pay for that when we leave and that'll go down. Sick. Oh, it's blocked off down there. It's blocked off? There's like cones and stuff. Why is that? I don't know.
to see what they mean by it's pretty steep. <laughs> Look at that. And it's not even like, it's, it's those stairs that you were pointing out at Shirijo Castle, but yeah, they're slanted. Yeah. And of course it literally started to rain as we pulled up. It's been raining all day, past few days, honestly. And it stopped and we're like, oh, let's go out. Let's go into town. Pull up, starts raining. There's a bunch of little stuff on this road too, you know? Like houses. We just passed a guy that literally went to his home. <laughs> yeah, houses, but like little joints, like whatever that is. Yeah. Like maybe There's a little someone behind you cafe. too. So, oh yeah? Mm -hmm. Nice. When he said, you can drive on it. No way. No way. Oh, you can. <laughs> you can. <laughs> I wonder if that baby's four wheel drive. <laughs> oh, there was a cat just now. I read on the reviews, it's lucky if you see a cat. But um, we're just about at the end. It's starting to get really slippery. You can't really tell on the video too much, but it's kind of like, it's like this. So we're gonna head back up before the rain makes it even worse and it's more difficult to go up. I would be so scared to drive this on two wheels. And it's slippery and mossy. I know. Wow. Pretty cool tree. Very cool tree. I'm trying so hard not to breathe heavy because it's like the mask just makes it worse. It does. I'm, I'm just gonna, trying to be respectful. I'm pull it down, same. Because we have passed multiple people in here. Yeah. Like holding the umbrella with one arm means I'm having to hold the, the gimbal, gimbal with one arm. And this thing's like, <laughs> I think gimbal and camera together are like 10 pounds. Yeah. Imagine just walking up a 20% incline with a 10 pound dumbbell straight out. Yeah. A lot of people said not to come at night because it gets so dark with like all the trees and stuff. But honestly, like it's this is fun. such a vibe. Like I truly think that I wanted to come here over coming here at sunset. The I think night sunset still would have been cool too though. The sunset, of course, because but like the nightlife of yeah. the city and stuff, like this is so cool. This is like sure. such a cool experience because do you see this in the States, you know? Just like a random, like historic stony walkway, you know? I know. It's so cool. It's like we live here and get to experience stuff like this all the time. For real. I wish some of these joints were open, but I think with the lockdown just now ending, some places are still I agree. feeling the effects, you know. Totally. So. Let's hike this bad boy back up. how dark that is oh my gosh I can't so steep what a vibe oh we're close look at that twenty one just made it back yeah twenty one Oh, it laid down. Sweet. Nice. All these outdoor activities, they're so tiring. Well, I'm glad we got to experience that. Sometimes the littlest, like, adventures that we think are going to be small turn out to be, like, some of the coolest, and that was definitely cool. Yeah. Even though the rocks got pretty slippery, but... Definitely come back for sure. Oh yeah, definitely for like pictures, like sunset or yeah, early in the morning, mm -hmm. whatever. Yeah, I need to be and so see. bad. And she's got a pee, so we're gonna cut it off right here. Thanks for tuning in, guys. Uh, we'll catch you either in the next vlog or the next little adventure series. So, peace.